So this is the Rhine Falls of Switzerland. So did you know that according to the facts, this Rhine Falls is located in Switzerland in the, in the cantons or when we say cantons, these are the municipalities of Switzerland. They term is, it as cantons. So this falls is under Skaffhausen and Zurich, so in between of the two of them. So they give this access to the public to these two municipalities. And uh, this is in northern Switzerland. And it is a very nice falls actually. It's the most powerful falls in Europe. So that's how it's, it was noted. So I have to adjust the video. <laughs> so this one, no? Yeah, that one. So this one is the most powerful fall in Europe. So this one, yes. It, I don't know if you can, I can explain the feeling if you're in, in the middle of the waterfalls. So did you know that uh, this, this uh, waterfalls has has a very much uh, influence in in the whole Switzerland. So, and this is 150 meters wide and 23 meters high. So that is the height of this fall. So the volume of the water it reaches uh, 250 cubic meter per second. So that's how powerful it is. So, but during summer the highest flow of water was measured 1250 cubic meters per second so in nine that's what that was in 1999 so that means uh, the swiss or the swiss germans were able to to measure the volume of water flow through this so there are plenty of uh, methods of measurement for these falls in the natural occurrence yeah so this is very nice and then according to the geology the Rhine Falls and the Rhine Felsen are were formed in the Ice Age so they said that it's approximately 14,000 to 17,000 years ago so this uh, this one is uh, yeah 500,000 years ago so up to the end of Wollstonian stage so approximately 132,000 years ago, the rainfall flowed westwards from Skaffhausen to Kleppgau. So this early riverbed later filled up with gravel. But this is the final flow huh? between these two cantons, Skaffhausen and Zurich. So it's very nice. Actually, uh, yeah, it has moved this place, this far place. And uh, did you know that uh, this has happened, it was formed also during the glaciation period. So glaciation period is the chains of the, the falls, the, the chains of it when, when there was an ice, uh, what they call this, the formation of ice, formation of limestone bed. Yeah, it is a very nice, uh, and in terms of economics also, uh, in the 17th century, a blast furnace for smelt iron ore found in the limestone was built. So there was already a blast furnace, furnace long ago. So it was in operation until the first half, half of the 19th century. So this is false. So, so in 1913 also in this area, there was an international competition for best plan for a shipping route between Basel and Lake Constance. So, so because they wanted to build a powerful station in northern Switzerland, they were told that any such station at the Rhine Falls must serve the economic interest to the public. So today falls, these falls, are under the consideration of hydropower projects. So the hydro hydroelectric power plant and if the full water flow were used, the power generated would average approximately 50 megawatts. So the economic value of the falls as a tourist attraction may be greater. So in terms of tourism, of course, I... So b bye for now, everyone.
thank you for um, subscribing watching to my youtube channel and uh, may, you see, may we see each other again on my next vlogs and uh, future endeavors thank you